in honor of Father's Day, let's talk about the father of the diesel engine. <sighs> Rudolf Diesel was a German born in the 1800s. By 1880, he's at Bavarian Polytechnic Institute, who I believe lost to Northern Arizona in the Sweet 16. After studying in thermal combustion cycles, he comes up with the idea for the diesel engine, patents the diesel engine in 1893, first successful test 1897. In 1913, boards a ship called the SS Dresden in Holland after refusing to exclusively license the diesel engine to Germany on the eve of World War I. After dinner on the first night, goes back to his room, leaves a message with the crew for a 6.15 wake up, is never seen again. There are three theories on his death. Theory number one, said he committed suicide because, as it turns out, he's practically bankrupt. Theory number two is that the Germans killed him so that he could not license diesel technology to the British. Theory number three is that with the help of the British government, he faked his death to help England advance their diesel technology because he didn't like what was going on in Germany. And there you go. That's a brief history of the father of the diesel engine. Happy Father's Day.